Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to be talking about this article from Electric. So basically it's saying that Tesla will be launching a new uh, Model Y long range rear wheel drive. And this is mainly for the European countries, right? So let's go through it and let's see what it has. So this is basically just telling um, that, you know, the last quarter Tesla didn't deliver, didn't meet their quota, you know, their shorts. Uh, and their stocks uh, fail, uh, and uh, thank God that Elon came out and talked more about the robo taxi, and that brought the stock prices back up a little bit. But however, here we're going to be looking at this. So as you can see right here, uh, Tesla Europe and Middle East uh, introducing the Model Y long range rear wheel drive. So this is not the first time Tesla done it. So they done it before with the with the Model Three as well too, and. And we can see right here, this is on kilometer. Let's go back, well, let's go here. We go, scroll down over here. So, the new Model Y long range rear wheel drive is now the second cheapest Model Y. Uh, starting at, you know, 48,000 pound, I guess, since it's in Europe. And we can say right here, so this is what uh, we're more concerned of, uh, 373 miles. So I think right now the long range, we're looking at about what, 311 or 333 when I first bought mine. And the wheel still stay the same at 19 inch Gemini wheels. And let's go down here are the countries that are available to uh, order. Australia, uh, Czechia, Denmark, Finland, so on. Belgium all the way down to Hungary. So... Electrics take. I love more powertrains options. There are plenty of people who don't recall um, need all wheel drive, but they need, they would need or prefer the longer range. So this is a no brainer. It should be available in all markets. So, for example, in like in my wife's case, um, she doesn't drive far. So she drives, you know, take the kid to school here and there, probably like about three, four miles uh, one way and back and forth. So, and she doesn't like speed like I do, you know. I got the long range and it, it, it's fast, it's 4.8 seconds from 0 to 60 and somehow I kind of regret it not getting the performance, you know, because it could have been like faster, 0 to 60, maybe what, 3.8 or 3.7 seconds. Now I have the option to, you know, to uh, ghost it, you know, just uh, get like a module from, Ingen I think, Nginx uh, and probably pay about 2000 uh, for the uh, module and have a ship order here, probably pay everything maybe twenty three, twenty five hundred dollars, and then install it, and then I can have the performance because my vehicle does have the uh, performance motors, so that's another option that I might go with as soon as my warranty ends. But like going back to my wife's case, you know, I mean, she doesn't travel a lot, she doesn't need, and she doesn't uh, like to speed. You know, she's happy with the uh, chill mode. You know, what I mean. So with this, I think Tesla would hit a, a lot of people that might be for the long, longer range than the speed. So it makes sense that they do offer. And I believe eventually Tesla use it, uh, test it out like in China and in other part of the countries and then bring it to the U.S. So eventually uh, we're going to see it in the U.S. as well. Yeah, but uh, that's pretty much it for this. Um, video guys thank you for watching if you have any questions feel free to leave it a comment below but other than that thank you until next time be safe